but it wasn't the Chevy, and no, it wasn't the Ford either. Actually, it was this Lincoln Navigator that I'm getting outside of that was the big winner today. We're talking about the North American Truck of the Year, and not only is this a prestigious award, but this is a big deal because this is the first time in a while that we've seen three American-made cars going at it, mano y mano, for that top truck spot. The Lincoln Navigator. <laughs> Big cheers as Lincoln is taking home big bragging rights. It's all about space and it's all about capability. But I asked the team behind it if it's a truck or an SUV and their response doesn't really matter. The customers basically look at it as a vehicle uh, that meets their needs and then the needs are all about capability and space and, and comfort. The Accord meeting the needs of voters, apparently, taking home top honors after complete redesign. Despite that, this car has more changes in its sights. The Accord story is not over because later on this year we'll be launching the Accord Hybrid, so we're very excited about that as well. In the 2018 North American Utility of the Year is the Volvo XC60. Volvo rounding out our award winners this year despite stiff competition against the Alfa Romeo and the Honda Odyssey. The award? A meaningful one for Volvo. I've been working for Volvo my whole life, so, so sometimes we don't have time to celebrate. This time they will. In fact, they're having so much fun, they pass around the award. In case you're wondering, it is quite the load. Don't worry, you didn't drop the award, no nicks, no scratches, but I'm a little worried about being inside the vehicle now because it just seems a little bit more valuable, right? The XC60, the Volvo, the utility vehicle of the year. Very cool to see the car and truck announced right here in Detroit as well. It's always a lot of excitement here in Detroit, and the excitement about these three vehicles is now going to push right on over to the auto showroom floor. It's going to be the buzz of the day. For the Now Detroit, I'm Matthew Smith.